So now that you have your bachelor's degree, what are you going to do now? There's a darkness on me that's flooded Benjamin. in light. Benjamin. Yo, Benny. What? What's next for you, bro? To be honest, I've been thinking about that a lot myself lately. And I really don't have an answer for you. But why are you even asking that question? You didn't go to school. And it was a huge mistake. I mean, I did a lot of partying. I had a lot of good times. But the funny thing about those good times is five to ten years later, I don't remember a damn thing. You went to work. I went to school. You didn't know what you wanted to do. But I can tell you from all the 18 years I've been in school, I don't want to be a little tiny component that works for a higher authority that tells you, don't do this, do that, pass, fail. I went to school to find myself, but I didn't find anything. It was bullshit. In the fine print they tell me what's wrong and what's right. I want you to get your bachelor's degree or your graduate degree. You just work for a company that reinforces the same limitations that were set in society just as watching Full House as a kid. What's wrong with you, kid? You've been depressed since mom and dad died 10 years ago. It's not mom and dad. Then what is it? It's... It's... It's ineffable. So you're telling me that you're pissed off at the world because someone's unfuckable? No, Angelo. It's something that's too complex. It's, it's deep-rooted. I mean, it's so deep-rooted. It just becomes unexplainable. Florida's a place where you come when you're waiting to die. I want to be free. Here's another big word for you, college boy. Illusory. It's really not a big word. All of this literature you've been reading in school, all of these great books that your professors tell you about, are filling your head with illusions. There is no such thing as freedom. You're clinging to a string, my friend. And people do that from time to time. We cling to things so we can feel alive. There's parts of our lives that we want to hold on to, you know? But all this depression, all this doubt is coming from within you. You know, freedom may not be plausible in a corporation where companies are essentially buying and selling their employees, but freedom's out there. Why do you need to leave? Because I'm trapped inside this town. I don't know what is out there. I need to make mistakes because I don't know if they're mistakes yet. You raised me, and I thank you for that. I appreciate it. But you, you treat me like a child. True freedom comes from being able to make choices and stick with them. I think your good grief stems from your lack of passion and just lack of love. <laughs> and I thought I was the delusional one, bro. It wasn't just you. It was just like love isn't real. It's fantasy. It's just another one of those strings that people cling to. Now listen here. These are probably the truest, most sincere words I've ever spoken to you. Love does exist. It just gets lost sometimes. You gotta find your own love. And before you do that, you have to find yourself. How will I know when I get to that point? Let's just say you'll never have to use that word ineffable again. Now get out of here. What about graduation? Screw it. This is way more important. Yeah, what am I gonna live off of? Love. Mom and Dad left you an extra chunk of cash. Uh, I've been saving it for a while. And uh, one of the stipulations was that I would give it to you on this day. On my graduation day? On the day that you decided to become a man. We always wondered if freedom was real. This is your chance to go find it. For you, for us. Upon me that's flooded in light In the fine print they tell me what's wrong and what's right There's a darkness upon me that's flooded in light